What's up guys, we're back with another epic video. We have the newest set, King's Court. I'm so excited to open this, guys. Two booster boxes of first edition King's Court. I've not opened any of this set yet. There's been some crazy cards in here. There's Lightning Storm, the reprint. It's, I think it's an ultra rare and collector's rare. There's also, of course, the Jack's Knight, the King's Knight, the Queen's Knight. The God cards are in here in a new rarity. It's going to be crazy. There's so many good things. Rhoda, Collector Rare. There's just a lot of really good stuff that we can pull. So I'm pretty excited about this. But before we open those up, I have a couple of epic openings to announce or at least to mention. We have the Power of the Duelist First Edition Hobby Box. This is going to be opened on Sunday, I think. Power of the Duelist Ultimate Rare is pulled. Hopefully the Dark Neos and the Flare Neos huge card so this is going to be really cool to see open i'm going to be opening this for myself so it's going to be pretty exciting i can't wait to hopefully get some epic pulls and then you guys have heard about this one on instagram and in yesterday's video tonight 4 30 p.m central time we're opening up this pharaoh servant first edition box on whatnot it's going to be crazy go check out the stream there you got to follow me check out the link in the description it'll go right to my page you can follow me you can save the show at 4 30 p.m central it's about four and a half hours from when this video drops and finally we have a giveaway i'll be giving away these three cards all original print cards all you have to do is like this video be subscribed let me know what you're most excited about from king's court it's going to be a good one all right, let's jump right into the very first box we're going to open on the channel. I will probably do a live stream. I have a couple of cases of this, so I may do a live stream like probably not this weekend because I don't think I'll have them and I'll be out of town. So um, probably next week at some point, we're going to open up some King's Court live. So if you guys are interested in that, make sure you you know subscribe so you guys can see some more epic openings. I think these have been mappable. So we're gonna we're gonna mix these up. I'm gonna actually open up both boxes so everything's super mixed up. All right, guys, I've done some crazy mixing here. We have 48 packs, so we are searching for those god cards. That's the number one, and then we also have the chance of collectors rares like reinforcement of the army. We have uh, the lightning storm is gonna be a big one as well. There's some other great cards like rescue rabbits in here, so it's pretty exciting. Hopefully, we can pull something big out of these two boxes. But if we don't, we have more coming. So there's a rescue rabbit. You can get that collector rare, arcana extra joker. And Stellar told me and White Rose Cloister. I think this set officially releases like tomorrow. I think you'll be able to get it at your local stores today. So I was able to get mine. So hopefully you guys can get some if they have it available. It's a pretty cool set. There's a lot of throwback cards, which is pretty exciting. Pendulum XCs, Golden Eyes Idol, Ultimate Shield, and Tindangle D holes. Alright, we got the D holes. <laughs> Here we go. Third pack. We have two whole boxes here, so hopefully we can pull something good. Usually collectors are one out of three, though, so you're probably not going to... Well, you're not necessarily going to get one out of two boxes. Infinite infinite cards got to reprint, finally. XC's Hyper Cannon, so maybe that'll bring down that LON value. Maybe it's a decently valued rare out of LON, even unlimited. Probably because there's not many printings of it. Okay, King's Court. We got... <laughs> King's Court. King's Knight, we got the Utopia. Infinite cards again. Eternal Bond. We're returning live. Joker's Wild, check that out. That's a pretty scary looking Joker, I like that. Next pack, here we go. Can we get the God cards? I've seen that you usually only get, it's zero to one God card per case. So they are pretty rare, like they're not easy to pull. They come in two different rarities. It's the new rarity and ultra rare, or it's something like that, I can't remember. It's either that or it's, I've seen different things, which is why I'm not sure. Or it's the new rarity and secret rare. I'm not sure, I think the secret is the new rarity it's actually called like egyptian rarity or something crazy like that i can't remember what they started calling it gravekeeper spies in here cool reinforcement of the army there it is rose princess there's a super rare let me know if any of these super rares are actually worth anything the price guides are not up yet so I, it's pretty much just a guesstimate at this point all right we've got the wicked dread root come on let's get something good the newest Yu Gi Oh set pretty exciting to actually get a good collector rare set for the first time in a while XC's Hyper Cannon, because we've been getting some pretty bad ones, like Ancient Guardians was not very good. The one before that, what was it? It was not as bad as that one, but it, it wasn't very good either. I can't remember what it was called now. Okay, Pendulum XC's, Ties of Brethren, Night Joker, Gravekeeper Spy, with the Utopia Ray, and the Phantom of the Angzing. I don't want to try and read that first name. Next pack, here we go. Can we pull something good? All right, Cloud Castle, Future, 
Utopia. Lots of Utopia in here. Queen's Knight. And Joker's Knight, our first ultra rare of the video. And a reminder, only three ultras per box. So you don't get too many of them. Joker's Knight, that's pretty cool. 2,000 attack, 5 star. Pretty nice. I like that. I'm gonna push I'm gonna push these over to the side a little bit so it can be yeah we can push these a little far farther back so better lighting here we go here we go we've got one ultra rare so far we get the warrior returning live majestic dragon that got a reprint ultimate shield I think it was like eleven dollar super or something out of a oh morph king stygy gel okay 100 each interesting what is this guy he's a tuner so if you're trying to synchro summon there you go all right what do you guys like the most about this set? Do you guys like the set? Do you not? If you do, what's your favorite card? What do you, you know, surprises for you? Let me know in the comments. I want to see all that stuff. Rival, rivalry, of, rivalry of the Warlords. I think that's a collector's rare as well. That's cool. XC's Hyper Cannon. Okay. I think a live stream of this will be pretty fun. Searching for some god cards. So we, we're definitely going to have to do that. Arcane Knight Joker. We got Arcane Extra Joker. We got the Link Monster for it. Zolga. Unexpected Die, that needed a reprint. And Rose Princess, I think Unexpected Die, unless it had got reprinted already, was like a $10 rare. It was really expensive. Rare or common, what set was it from? It was from like a... It was from a Zexel set, I think. Or maybe it was Arc V, I can't remember. It was not that old, but it was still really expensive. Ultimate Shield. And Thunder Speed Summon. Okay. Okay, okay, can we get a collector rare? Can we get a god card? Here we go. I would love to pull that. That'd be pretty exciting. Let's see, we got a Utopia, Zen Mayo, Infinite Cards, Eternal Bond, The Warrior Returning Alive, Majestic Dragon, Scrap Twin Dragon. Wow, that's a throwback. Scrap Twin Dragon, unless that's a new card. I don't remember the Scrap Twin, but of course the, they've been making like Scrap Dra Scrap Raptor they just made in the last set made you know the release whatever whatever you say that invented a new card rival of the warlord i can't say that card scrap twin dragon again rivalry of the warlords why is that so hard to say i don't know i don't know why it's so hard to say guys okay all right i'm pretty excited about tonight though pharaoh servant is gonna be pretty fun reinforcement of the army so make sure you guys come check it out if you haven't already imperial bower okay imperial Bower? Bower? I don't know. I'm not good at reading. <laughs> Yu-Gi-Oh, guys. You're not supposed to be good at reading. Very cool. Our third Ultra Rare. Now, already. So, that's pretty good. Um, and speaking of the Pharaoh Servant, it's just a stream. So, if you don't want to actually auction, you don't actually have to. You can just come watch, which is fun as well. Pot of Duality. Come on. Let's get it. Let's get something big. Majestic Dragon. Cloud Castle. Utopic Future. And Yang Zing. All right, okay. Next pack. I have no idea how to tell how many packs left. There's a lot left. There's still a lot. <laughs> what will it be? Majestic Dragon. We got the Ultimate Shield. Cloud Castle. Converging Wishes. Rescue Rabbit. Extra Joker. And a Fortune Tune. Number 49 Fortune Tune. That's either a reprint or the art of, the, of a different card, like a very similar art with that blue bird thing. I don't remember. The Wicked Eraser, that's a jump reprint, isn't it? Dowsing Fusion, I think it is. So is this, the Wicked Dreadroot, that's a jump reprint as well. Oh, interesting. Eagle Claw. And Evil Czar Dolka, we got another Ultra. I don't know what these are going to be valued at. You're going to be seeing it on the screen when I edit because I did not see any prices. So, yeah. We're just going to try and pull some cool stuff. We get the Gravekeeper Spy, Utopia Ray, Ultimate Shield. Pendulum transfer. We got the pod of duality. Wind up Zen Mao. What is this? What? Same ultra evil sword, evil czar Dolka. Okay, that's kind of weird, but okay. Two in a row, the same thing. We really want lightning storm. Yeah, that's that's. I'm pretty sure it comes as an ultra, and a collector's rare. So we would definitely want it as an ultra. That's a pretty good card. Ties the brother. We got the. There's another jump. They, they reprinted a ton of jump cards. Rivalry of the Warlords. There we go. Nailed it. Extra Joker. Court of Cards. Okay, these are these are cool. Some pretty cool cards in here. I'm a fan so far of this set. Art's pretty cool as well. Okay, Pendulum Transfer. Pot of Awesome. Very cool. The Pot of Awesome is here in here. Infinite Cards. Warrior Returning Alive. And Face Card Fusion. 
Fusion Summon 1 Light Warrior Fusion Monster from your extra deck. Using monsters from your hand or field as fusion materials. Cool. That's pretty cool. Okay. All right, all right, all right. The warrior returning alive. We got Jack's Knight. King's Knight. Very nice. Converging Wishes. The Yang Zing. Dao Zing Fusion. And Joker's Wild. He's definitely wild. Very wild. Creepy as well. Okay, okay, guys. Can we pull Collector Rare? Come on, God Card. Converging Wishes. Unexpected Die. Told me. Queen's Knight. Dowsing Fusion. Zolga. World Legacy Guard Dragon. This is a reprint. That's a reprint. That's a pretty old reprint, I think. We still got like, feels like 20 packs left. Like we've got a lot left. We've already pulled five ultras. Does that mean we're only gonna get one more? I'm not totally sure. I think that's what that means, but I'm, oh, there's the Ruxton special. Tornado Bringer. He brings the tornado. Golden Eyes Idol. Yes, look at this guy. Oh my goodness, that's amazing. The Wicked Avatar. And Magnet Induction. We got a Magnet card in here. All right. Love to see that. Get those good old magnets back out there. Whew, Cloud Castle. We got the King's Knight. Majestic Dragon. Utopia. Xylong. Extra Joker. Scrap Twin Dragon. Again, it's a play set of those. Just in case we want to Synchro Summon him three times. Oh. Okay. Unexpected Die. Warrior Returning Alive. Jack's Knight. King's Knight. Converging Wishes. Yang Zing. Crystal Girl. That's the first time we've seen the Crystal Girl. So, uh, pretty cool. How many supers are in this set? Is it 10 still? Or have they up upped it again? I can't remember. Rescue Rabbit. Extra Joker. Dreadroot. Wicked Eraser. The Golden Eyes Idol. Gotta love it. And White Rose Cloister. Not the Cloister from Pokemon. Next pack. Here we go. The next pack. Will it have a Collector Rare? Can I Joker? Arcane Extra Joker, Leo Arms, Zolga the Prophet, Unexpected Die, the Wicked Eraser, Hyper Galaxy, got a super rare, okay, okay, that's cool, that's cool, what do we got in here, we've got Utopic Future, that's, that is cool, Knight, Rivalry, Reinforcement of the Army, if you needed stuff for your goat deck, this is it. Tin dangles, we got the D holes. Yet again, more D holes, guys. Don't you love to have the D holes? Very, very good. Very good. All right. Next up Queen's Knight, Dowsing Fusion, Zolga the Prophet, Cloud Castle, King's Knight, Majestic Dragon, and Joker's Wild. Okay, we really did like pull all the ultras. Okay, we still have like 10, 12 packs left, though. Come on, Collector Rare. Come on, God Card. Let's go. Dowsing Fusion, the Wicked Dreadroot, Pendulum Transfer, Eagle Claw. Come on, come on. King's Knight, World Legacy Guard Dragon. Okay, okay. Do you believe? Hit the like button if you believe. Let me know what you think about the new set. Also, let me know what we're about to pull because we're going to pull something big. Lightning Storm, Collector Rare, God Card, Secret Rare, Obelisk, the Tormentor. Okay, not that time. Slifer the Sky Dragon. I would probably want Obelisk or Slifer. Oh, we dropped it. I think Slifer will look the best. The problem with Obelisk and his artwork is he takes up the whole artwork. So if it's something about being in the background, it's really hard to see. I just Rux and Special that and had no idea. I just went through both of those. Ties of the Brethren. Tornado Bringer. Magnet Induction. We are down to the last few packs, guys. The last few packs. We should at least have another Ultra Rare. Because it's been a very long time. Probably like 15 packs since we pulled one. We've got a Utopia, Zenglong, Extra Joker, Pendulum XCs, Ties the Brethren, the Wicked Eraser, and the Fortune Teller. Okay, another Fortune Teller. Come on. Let's pull something big. Can we pull the Obelisk, the Tormentor, Slide of the Sky Dragon, Wing Dragon of Raw? We want any of those. They're big. They're awesome. Let's pull them. Ultimate Shield, Cloud Castle, White Rules Cloister. Okay, another Pokemon. Come on. Next pack, Ultimate Shield, oh, Rex and Special, Pot of Duality, Zen Mouth, Eternal Bond, Infinite Cards, Fortune Teller again, okay. Okay, come on, you gotta believe, guys. Believe that we're gonna pull it, because right now we are not giving any sort of implication that we're gonna pull it. That's why, because we're not, you know, we're taking it seriously now. We were just kidding at the beginning, we were just kidding. Now we're getting serious, we're gonna pull something big. King's Court, here we go. Come on. 
Converging wishes. Unexpected die. Conseller told me. Queen's Knight. Dowsing Fusion. Joker's wild. Again, he's very wild. He doesn't want us to pull anything. The Queen's Knight. Come on. Come on. Check out some of these epic cards. We want to get something big. Rivalry of the Warlords. I can't say it. Yang Zing. Jack's Knight. Ties the Brethren. Lightning Storm Ultra Rare. There's a big one. We got a very good one. This one I think was around 50 bucks. But you never know with those pre-sale prices. Keep that in mind. Not everyone has gotten their cards yet like me. You know, just like regular people who open stuff up. They haven't gotten their Lightning Storms and sold them yet. So there's going to be a lot more people when this actually officially releases. So it might go down. It does come a Collector's Rare though, which will be more. So we got another Lightning Storm. If you guys remember, we actually pulled Lightning Storm. Um, Prismatic, what's it called? I just forgot. Starlight Rare. When, in its original set. We actually pulled the Starlight of it, which was really awesome. Super expensive. It was crazy. It was so awesome. So maybe I'll link that video. It's a pretty old video at this point, but it was pretty awesome. Leo Arms and Hyper Galaxy. That was actually super hype. I think that was the first Starlight I ever pulled. And it was by far the best one. It was like $425 at the time, something like that. Very good. Very good. Pendulum Transfer. I mean, it's one of the early uh, Starlight sets, so it was pretty cool. Utopia. Zen Moth. And Crystal Girl. I did try to pull... Um, What's it called? Out of the very um, uh, what's that? What's the what's the link card called that's been reprinted a couple times now? But it was the first in the first Prismatic Starlight set. I can't remember now. Why risk? Okay, I gotta think. Apollosa. That's right. I tried to pull. I opened several packs for that. Probably a couple hundred. Uh, trying to get it, which you know you need to open a lot more to actually get it. But um, we never got did. Evan. We never did get it. So maybe we'll get it one day. Not the Golden Eyes Idol. Wicked Avatar. Unexpected die. And magnet induction. So we've gotten all of our ultra rare pulls now. Will we actually get a collector rare? Or will we get a god card? We will see. Ties of the Brethren, the Wicked Avatar, Utopia Ray, and World's Legacy Guard Dragon. We've gotten a lot of those. We have three packs left, guys. Out of two boxes. We have pulled six ultra rares. The unfortunate part about this stuff is you only pull like six ultras or whatever. That's like the only pulls if you don't get like one of the big ones, like the uh, collector's rare and stuff. So it's a little bit, I don't know, it feels like you open a lot to get a little. But that's kind of my only gripe with these sort of sets, but I do of course like the collector's rares, they're really cool. Alright, Tornado Bringer, we got the Zong Long, Eagle Claw, Leo Arms, Gravekeeper Spy, Utopia Ray, and a Thunder Speed Summit, kind of looks like Lightning Storm, that's pretty cool. And we're down to the final pack, King's Court. If this has something crazy in it, I'm going to lose it. Final pack. Here we go. Leo Arms. Zolga Prophet. Unexpected Die. The Wicked Eraser. Tornado Bringer. Dowsing Fusion. And Magna Induction again. Okay, so we didn't get anything crazy in this video. Well, we did get something pretty crazy, like a $50 card. We didn't get any of the Collector's Rares or God Cards, I mean. So we got six Ultras. A nice, easy recap, though. Two of the same. I hope that's a good one. I have a feeling it's not, but then we have uh, these and Lightning Storm, so pretty fun to open those up. We're going to open more in the future. Let me know if you're interested in the live stream in the comments. It's going to be pretty fun. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Don't forget Pharaoh Servant First Edition on Whatnot tonight, 4.30 p.m. Central. Check it out. And this weekend, we're going to have the PSA Return for Dark Magician and Injection Fairy Lily. We're also going to have Power of the Duelist Ultimate Rares pulled out of that hobby box. It's going to be crazy. So hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys later. Peace. Shining Abyss. Ooh, the Revival Jam. Oh, and oh!